I'm here with Dave Shanahan with Gardner Denver. Dave, tell me about the next generation controls product. Well, there's thousands of uh, Hoffman and Lampson blowers installed in wastewater plants around the world. Mm -hmm. And most of them utilize a constant seed motor and uh, inlet throttling to control for flow. Mm -hmm. But with technology today, there's uh, ample opportunity to apply uh, inverter drive on the blower uh, that can substantially uh, improve the energy efficiencies that customers see with those blowers. Okay, great. Now. How would a plant know if they need to upgrade to the next generation controls products versus investing in a new high speed blower replacement? Well, the first thing they can do is they can contact us and so we can come there and do an energy audit because mm -hmm. it's not a simple answer. You just look and say yes or no. You have to actually go through some of the analysis and see what their demand is and how it applies to the blowers they actually have. Mm -hmm. And then we can determine, okay, can we make a couple small changes to the blower? or is it such that they probably need a new system such as the Revolution, and that's just a balance of which is the best solution for the customer in terms of what they're going to spend and what cost savings they'll see over you know, the life of the equipment. Now you mentioned the Revolution. Will this save more power than the Revolution? Again, it's application specific. There will be cases where the Revolution will be far more efficient and there will be cases where the uh, next gen controls will be more efficient. It's uh, Each plant's different. They have different number of blowers. Mm -hmm. uh, they have different demands in terms of uh, flow and pressure over a given year. Mm -hmm. And they have changes in seasons. So Florida would need one solution. New York State may need another solution. But again, it's something we can support them in. All right, now going back to the Revolution. Revolution versus this product. Explain to me the differences, similarities with it. Uh, well, the main difference is the next gen is using, uh, the, the blower can, technology it's using is the multi-stage blower. So we'd go in there and use a, uh, a VFD on the multi-stage blower. So that's a technology that's, that's actually providing the air. Okay. Where the Revolution, it's the high-speed single stage, mm -hmm. which is using the magnetic bearings and primarily uses speed to control the flow. Uh, so that, that's the primary difference, is, is what's delivering the air to the system. Okay, and where can we find more information? Well, we can reach at hoffmanandlampson.com or people can call 1-800-543-7736. Great, thanks Dave. Yep.